Hello and welcome to my Descript edit and export transcript tutorial. Here I'm going to show you exactly what I mentioned where you can edit any of your text in the transcript and of course how you can actually save it for future use. So why would you want to do this? For example, in this video, you're going to notice, well, you might not know that my last name isn't Kennel. However, there's going to be reasons why you might want to change this. For example, if you have subtitles, if you have captions, if you want to save this and maybe paste it onto a blog post, you want to make sure that your words look great. Or for example, if you said like, I want to go here instead of changing it to I want to. So let me show you how to do that. For example, I'm going to highlight this because they got my last name incorrect here, which is probably going to happen, right? So you'll notice this, I have captions here. So we're going to want to change that. What I can do after I highlight it, click on correct. Let me change this up. Let's click on correct. And usually what it's going to do, it's going to underline, give it a few seconds to change. It'll optimize, not optimize, but it'll update with everything. There you go, Canzanella. And now it's going to be good to go. I'm going to play it just very quickly. Hey, what's going on? It's James Canzanella, your affiliate here. Okay, so there we go. Now, now that we've done that, I mean, and let me show you one more way of doing it just if you want to do it. So what you can do is click on the arrow here, click on correct. And what you can do, of course, is just click on a specific word. I'm not sure if there's anything here I would change. Cause, okay, there we go. So there we go. Because, instead of cause, right? So correct. And just like that, that's how you can change it as well. All right, easy stuff, right? So that's how you can edit it, make corrections. Once again, we have cause there, that's fine. Now allow me to show you how you can actually save just the transcript, okay? Maybe you just want that. Let's click on publish here. And what you want to do here is go to export. And now let's just go to transcript, okay? So you can do video, audio, GIF, timeline, transcript, subtitles, that's gonna be up to you. You can utilize any of these, that's gonna be up to you as well. And Microsoft Word, you could do it as plain text, say like a notepad file, but once you have that done, just click on export and that's how you can actually save your transcript. So that's the tutorial for editing and saving your transcript if you wanna use that in a Word document. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. If you happen to be watching this video and you're curious about testing out Descript, the link for free access will be down below in the description. My name is James, I hope this tutorial helped you out and I will see you in my next video.